Okay, today I'm going to show you an experiment to separate a mixture of copper to carbonate, which is in the beaker. Okay, you can see its color, copper to carbonate. And then we have 10 centimeter cube of... Uh, 10 centimeter cube of uh, HCl. Okay, we have to measure 10 centimeter cube of HCl. You need a, fil um, a filter funnel. And then you, you need a filter paper, of course, which you, you need to fold it. Okay, which we need to fold it. Okay, like this. You can see. Many times. And then I'm going to take the HCl and pour it into the copper carbonate. Okay, check out what happens. Okay, you can see effervescence. Okay, you can hear uh, like a sound of effervescence. Okay, so when ca copper carbonate reacts with HCl, there is copper chloride and carbon dioxide and water which which are formed. Okay. Now, as you can see, it, it is reacting. Now, what we're going to do is, we're going to filter it, okay, so that we remove the unreacted copper carbonate, okay. So, I'm going to pour it. So you can see. So after you have filtered it, you will get copper chloride, and in the filter funnel will be the uh, cup, uh, the, the copper carbonate which is not used. And then what we're going to do here is uh, filtrate. Okay, it's a bit colorless. Okay, so now what we're going to do, we're going to add a bit of ammonia. Okay, so that we show that there is copper present. Okay, to see whether it's copper. Okay, so this is my ammonia. Okay, and then I'm going to add a visit that will be a okay, you see the change that has happened. Therefore copper is present. Okay. And it's not the end. Okay, thank you.